Dealing with 3D printer failures is never easy. In fact, we've been doing Print Fix Friday for over 80 weeks now, and people still seem to have problems. But I have the solution. Trust me, this is gonna be amazing. I, hey, I, I, I didn't see you there. I was browsing my favorite website, Goop, where we found solutions. Gwen the Paltrow is truly a visionary when it comes to everything medical and fixable in your life. In fact, that's where I got this lab coat. That's how you know you can trust me. We've got a old 3D printer here, one that didn't have thermal runaway protection, and I've got the solution. Finally figured out how to make this printer run again. Take a look at this. If you were thinking essential oils is the way to solve every one of your print failures, you guessed correct. With these two essential oil diffusers, with that wonderful fire effect, just to remind this printer of its previous past, we are able, as long as we choose the right scent, to convert this printer and make it work once again with just a couple of drops of this orange oil right here, we're gonna change this printer forever. You can see, brand new, just broke the seal. <laughs> I've made a horrible mistake. We're gonna keep the cameras rolling. But that was tea tree oil. I've never seen this work before with tea tree oil, so bear with me. We're gonna see what happens. Just watch, just watch. It's gonna happen, it's gonna happen, come on. Get the vapor, get the vapor. Come on, come on. It worked! It worked! Victoria, you mad lad! Oh, but this isn't... I put orange oil. Victoria, th this was orange oil, right? We, we, we went through this in the, in, in the pre-show notes. It's, it's tea tree oil. This is a Sovol! I wanted a Prusa! Everybody knows I shill for Prusa! I have to have a Prusa! Oh, we gotta, we gotta try this, we gotta try this again. Okay, all right, I got it. Orange, brand new, this is fresh from Goop. We know this is the highest quality stuff out there. Oh, reminds me of the fields of Florida. Doing bath salts with Florida, man. Couple of drops, couple of drops, let's, let's, let's do it. Okay. One, and two. Come on. Joseph, I know you can hear me. I know you can hear me. I know you can hear me. Prusha! What? Prusha! It worked! Prusha! It's a little green. That might that, that might have been the tea tree oil, but it it, it it's fine. It's fine because if it was blue, it would be dead. Uh, but but we got it. It worked. Gwyneth, you are amazing. This is exactly what I've been needing. This is a Prusa Mark III S, and for the low price of eleven ninety nine plus tax and shipping, this thing is amazing. But this is a Mark III S. I wanted a Mark IV. I paid for a Mark IV. We gotta try again, we gotta try again. This, this I'm told. This, right here, I'm, I'm told is the answer. Victoria tells me that I have to trust the process. And then if I add this oil, this essential oil, I will get essentially what I'm looking for. Let's, let's try it. Okay, what, what is this? Oh no, what have I done? Oh no! Oh yeah! No! We added too much lemon! How do we, how do we get rid of it? Leave a comment! How do we, hold on, wait! I think I know what to do! I, I think I know what to do! Get, get away! Get away! Okay, um. I'm told, I'm told you need a lemon to make lemonade. So, let's see if we can squeeze it. I can't squeeze it. 
It needs more orange. Hold on. Hold on. It needs more orange. Please. I need a mark for Joseph Prusa. Joseph Prusa. Joseph Prusa. Victoria. You did it with the power of goop. Not gloop. Still good, but nowhere near as powerful. We have it. The Prusa Mark IV. It was worth it. $11.99 plus shipping, import duties, and taxes. It was all worth it. We have it. The first Mark IV. It's right here in my hat. Wait a minute. I don't get it. I'm told there was gonna be a sign, a message, something. I listened, I did everything right. The formula, a sign from above. Is this Mrs. Paltrow? Mrs. Mrs. Paltrow, yes, hi, yes. I, 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 I ordered the essential oil set from Goop, yes. Yeah, I know, I know. They're sold out completely, I know. I think I, I was probably the first one. And I, I followed the direct, okay, I, I might have thrown the directions out, but I, I'm, I'm pretty sure I followed them perfectly. And all I have is this image of a Mark IV. Mrs. Paltrow, how, 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 how do I get a Mark IV? N no, no, I already paid. It said one easy payment, not a hundred. I can't afford that. I have a YouTube channel. We just, hold on guys. Okay. I. Uh, we're good? Cool? Wait, what? Uh, you have a message? Oh, yes. Like, subscribe. Happy April Fools. Stay safe out there. Don't forget to call your loved ones. And as always, keep making awesome. Have a good one. This is, uh, this is Editor Andrew. <laughs> Say hello, Andrew. Hello, Andrew. Have a good one, guys. <laughs> and, oh yeah, if you want my actual opinions on the Mark IV, the theoretical Mark IV that's supposed to be here. Get subscribed because that's Wednesday's video if you couldn't have figured it out yet. See you later.